Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you one of the best ways to level up your Tailed Beast in Roblox Shinobi Life 2 so you can go ahead and try and get the Zin Cloaks nice and easy. So hopefully this will help you guys out a nice amount and now let's go ahead and get started. Um, if you're a new player and you're trying to level up your beast, try not to go berserk at all. Well, you can if you want to, but isn't really the best way to level up. So what you need to do if you're like a beginner, it's not as easy if you're like a new player like this, but it's okay. So what you can do is, um, the first thing that you can do, it's not going to be that good. I'm not sure if it even does anything for this, for these first few forms until you have flash but you can go ahead and spam this by doing z1 z2 and so forth and then that can give you some exp i'm at, at least i'm hoping for these non flash forms and then what you need to do mostly is just use the mo moves so you're going to use the wall and then also like the hands or whatever moves that you have for your tailed beast so once you do get high enough to get um, a form with the flesh out kind of like this one so once you have a form that will look like this, that one resembles this, you can see that, that this is the part where you can really start leveling up fast. So I realized that I can spam um, the transform, and then whenever you get to this form, your um, tailed beast will war. So you can use that war to go ahead and attack a log. So make sure you're close to a log for this, and then like do whatever, like the whatever number they use for your flesh form, say it's Z1, Z2, Z3, Z4, and so on and so forth. Mine is Z4. So just make sure you have your highest form for this. And then, um, it's this one may, mostly works if you only have these flesh forms like this. So all I have to do is just keep on spamming it like this over and over again because you don't really need to wait for any cooldown at all. It's crazy OP. So you just have to keep on doing this over and over again you don't even have to wait for it to finish the war. You just gotta see the dance because it only does the damage once. You just gotta keep on doing that. It's insanely quick and easy. And in between those things, um, you just launch those attacks. Like, I'm gonna use a tail beast bomb. Use tail beast bomb, the war, or whatever attacks that you have. And then right after that, you just continue transforming. And then that's pretty much all you do. It's just insanely good for leveling up. My friend Trad Hat's using it to level up his tail beast, so... Yeah, I taught this to Trad Hat, it's insanely OP, and Whitey has the bone form. So, insanely good way, and insanely easy way to transform. All you gotta do, staying close to a log, you gotta make sure you're close to a log for this. And then just keep on spamming mode. I don't know, I'm just, I might be pat soon, I'm not sure if this is a glitch or something. But yeah, it's just something that I can just keep on doing over and over again. Just make sure you use the moves whenever the cooldown's over because those will give you an even more exp and then you'll get a ton of levels insanely fast so you saw that i was like 824 i'm still at 824 but i'm almost at 825 and i just hit, and I just hit 824 Hat says just by doing the war it does like 5k par so insanely op at least for trad hat it's been insanely op and well for me too so that's gonna be it for this video of how to um level up your tail beast fast so as i said earlier it does work best on these flesh forms because yeah the flesh forms once you do have your flesh form you are gonna let out a war which will do damage and that will level you up in return so yeah that's it so hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys subscribe to kids in the pod if you want some more videos like this one hopefully this did help you guys out a nice amount and i'll see you guys next time bye guys